There are over 200 species of solitary bee in Britain, and all of them are excellent pollinators. Now, as their name suggests, they don't have colonies. Instead, they raise their young individually, many of them in little holes and cavities. To encourage these brilliant workers into your garden, give them somewhere to raise a family. This is a solitary beehive. Each of these little holes is the entrance to a tunnel in which a bee can lay its eggs and raise its young. And it may lay several eggs, blocking each chamber off, creating cells as it goes down each tunnel. Now bees like it hot, so where you put your hive is all important for success. Pick a spot that's going to catch the sun facing south or southeast and don't position the box too high. On the ground is fine if it's in a place where it's not going to get disturbed or alternatively attached to a wall, no higher than two meters. Easy access to a food source is important too, so try and position your hive somewhere close to flowers in the garden. It's sometimes tricky to be certain whether or not bees are using your hive. You may find some little plugs of mud or maybe leaf matter from leaf cutting bees in the end of the holes. But some models like this one give you the opportunity to very carefully open up and check inside the cells. Solitary bees are an essential part of our ecosystem and they're not aggressive so they're fine around kids and pets so why not help them out and give them a home.